Welcome Amistad Eagles, all staff and students to our first ever Amistad Virtual Student Recognition Assembly. I'm Mrs. Para, a math teacher here and ASB advisor. Students and families will later be able to view this event on our school website. A special thanks goes out to Mr. Sean Webb, the Director of Community Engagement and Education Foundation, who made this event possible. We will start with our principal, Dr. Gustafson. Greetings, Amistad High School. This is Dr. Gustafson, the pr proud principal of Amistad High School, here to welcome you to our first virtual assembly for the 2021 school year. It is my privilege to introduce to you the recipients of the Student of the Month Awards. For September, Jasmine Portillo. For October, Danielle Della Riva. For November, Renee Pena. And for December, Jesus Havens. It is my great privilege to introduce to you our ASB president, Alexander Saucedo. Alex, will you please share the Staff of the Month recognition? I am Alex Salcedo, your ASB president. Our first quarter students nominated an award to Miss Arias. She is very supportive and outgoing as a teacher. She is overall great with her teaching skills. Our classified award goes to Miss Barrera. She is very helpful towards her students and just a overall genuine person. Our second quarter students nominate Mr. Buskirk. He is a cool teacher and very easy to learn from. The second quarter classified award goes to Mrs. Tiffany Amaya for keeping track of online activity and just making sure everyone is on time and ready to soar. Thank you and congratulations to our nominees. Thank you, President Alex. I will now announce the awards for students nominated by teachers. First quarter by Mr. Miller, we have Maria Reyes, who is caring has a caring personality and a wonderful attitude. Also by Mr. Miller, Destiny McNeil. She stays focused on completing assignments and is polite. Mr. Miller awards Anthony Ortiz for perfect attendance and being respectful. Mr. Buckskirk awards Eternity Alatore for great attendance and tenacity. Mr. Buzzkirk awards Isaac Garza for fantastic participation, even when all others don't pitch in. Mr. Buzzkirk awards Felix Torres Ancolo for most respectful student. Mr. Krauss awards Anthony Ortiz for most respectful student, for perfect attendance, respectful, 100% assignments turned in. Mr. Krauss awards Isaiah Baca for outstanding class participation and active learning. Mr. Krauss awards Brian Rodriguez for outstanding class participation and outstanding active learning. Mr. Wilson awards Gabriel Saceda, quarter one top male student in his social science classes. Mr. Wilson awards Jada Mendez, quarter one top female student in his social science classes. Mr. Wilson awards Perseus Machuca, quarter one most improved student in social science classes. Mr. Hernandez awards Jesus Havens for great attendance and excellent work ethic. Miss Neighbors awards Ashleen Ramos for putting forth effort and creativity in creating superior photographs. Miss Neighbors awards, awards Elijah Jester for consistently coming to class and completing his assignments. Miss Neighbors awards Eternity Alatori for con conscientious, reliable, productive, and creative all around great student. Miss Arias awards Dulce Padilla for consistent effort and productivity and enjoyable participation in meetings. Miss Stahl awards Nadia Zavala for uplifting and encouraging to herself and others. And Miss Stahl awards Elijah Jester for an active learner 
and demonstrating understanding above expectations. Ms. Stahl awards Mario Osorio Keller for a resilient learner. Ms. Barboza awards Isaac Bedoya for great participation, nearly perfect attendance, exceptional work effort, and completion. Ms. Barboza also awards Mario Osorio Keller for always participating and contributing to class discussions and give his best. For second quarter, we have by Mr. Wilson, Monica Flaum, quarter two top female student in social science classes. Mr. Wilson awards Brian Morales, quarter two top male student in his social science classes. Mr. Wilson awards Ramon Zavala Castaneda, quarter two most improved student in his social science classes. Mr. McKee awards Nadia Zavala, great attitude, attendance, and performance in his class. Mr. Curitan awards Daniel Nicole De La Riva, social, oops, excuse me, solid academic perseverance and punctuality to meetings. Mr. Curitan awards Laura Marie Towns, for solid academic perseverance and punctuality to meetings. And Mr. Curitan awards Monique Marie Espinoza, solid academic perseverance and punctuality to meetings. Ms. Stahl awards Hosea Brown for always attending class with a positive mindset. Ms. Stahl awards Maria Reyes Ojeda for uplifting, encouraging to self and others. Ms. Stahl awards Savannah Castillo Navarro for always attending class with a positive and resilient mindset. Ms. Stahl awards Prisaeus Machuca for being creative and open-minded in class discussions. Ms. Barboza awards Raul Vasquez Hernandez for dedication and resiliency respectful, always volunteers responses and willing to read. Ms. Barboza awards Adrian Sanchez for perfect attendance, academics exceptional and always willing to participate in class. Myself, Ms. Para awards Monica Flaum for being an outstanding Math 2 student. And from Ms. Para, Shirley Avila, also outstanding Math 2 student. Ms. Para awards Daniel Morales for outstanding math in financial literacy. And Cecilia Isidro, by myself, outstanding math one student. Mr. Kanigi awards Savannah Castillo Navarro for worked hard in math to graduate second quarter. And Mr. Kanigi awards Noesha Wilson for worked hard in math to graduate second quarter. Mr. Kanigi awards Gennaro Rodriguez for working hard in math to graduate this quarter. Ms. Arias awards Felix Torres Angelo for showing perseverance and determination to earn the grade and credits he knew he was capable of. Mr. Buskirk awards Genesis Cardenas for never failing to overcome challenges and tried hard in all her activities. Ms. Nava awards Guadalupe Arechiga for maintaining a C or higher second quarter. Ms. Nava awards Jesus Havens for maintaining a C or higher second quarter. Ms. Nava awards Ileana Legaspe Contreras for maintaining a B or higher second quarter. Ms. Nava awards Cecilia Isidro for maintaining C or higher second quarter. Excuse me, I alternated those. I'm so sorry. <gasps> Cecilia Isidro maintained a B or higher second quarter. Miss Nava awards Daniel Morales for maintaining a B or higher second quarter. And Miss Nava awards Isaac Morano for reclassifying as RFAP. 
Wow, that is a lot of student recognition. Thank you teachers and thank you for students for shining. Now we will hear some encouraging words from ASB students. The first day that the first day in Amistad was the best. My teachers had such a positive attitude. The one thing that I noticed my first week was that my teachers really went into depth with their lessons and made it more <laughs> entertaining so we could stay motivated. I'm Maria from ASB and my first impression of Amistad was to teach school where bad kids attend and it's a lot of drama. But now that this is my second year at Amistad High School, it has changed my mind. This school is where the teachers interact with you and really push you to succeed. All the kids there are nice and very intelligent. Thank you for letting me speak and have a wonderful day. Hi. I'm Nadia, ASB secretary. ASB has made it its goal to help students stay motivated this school year. One way we're doing it is by organizing after school events, such as Fun Time Thursdays. Personally, I enjoy Fun Time Thursdays because we get to interact with other students while doing some fun activities. Please keep an eye out for emails for future events. Words of encouragement from ASB. We are procrastinating sometimes because we are avoiding certain emotions. So let yourself feel whatever it may be, the fear of failure or sadness you choose to ignore. Then talk out a plan with the teacher. I promise they won't be mad at you. Don't quit because a month from now you will be that much closer to your goal than you are now. Yesterday you said tomorrow, make it, make it count today. Don't stop when you're tired. Stop when you're done. It is going to be hard, but hard doesn't mean impossible. We are eagles. Watch us soar. Now we will hear from our assistant, Principal Ms. Hoff. Welcome to third quarter. I am Sharon Hoff, assistant principal at Amistad High School, and I'm very happy that we're all here together, third and fourth quarter. I know a lot of you from first and second quarter when I visit classes, which I love to do, and I look forward third and fourth quarter to visiting more to get to know each one of you. Attendance is one of the keys. Attending every day, all day is one of the keys to success. And the following students, third, first and second quarter had excellent, excellent attendance. And I look forward to seeing more names on this list when we celebrate third quarter. Shirley Avila, Josea Brown, Luis Bustamante, Destiny Cano, Ariel Carmona, Ryan Duran, Fernando Fernandez, Luis Figueroa, Armando Fuentes, Kevin Godinis, Juliana Gonzalez, Carmen Guisar, Jesus Havens, Delena Hernandez, Alan Hernandez, Peter Hernandez, Cecilia Isidoro, Christian Jacobo, Jose Aramillo, David Jimenez, Luisao Juncal, Precious Manchua, Rosalinda Malara, Adrian Morales, Daniel Morales, Isaac Moreno, Aaron Orodica, Anthony Ortiz, Dulce Padilla, Damian Pantoja, Samantha Ramirez, Luis Rendon, Brian Rodriguez, Adrian Sanchez, Jose Soto, Jesus Tovar, Alberto Vallejo, Raul Varela, David Vega, Oscar Vega, Pablo Vega, Rocio Vega, and Nadia Zavela. And next, Dr. Gustafson with more awards. Thank you, Ms. Hoff, for the attendance awards and congratulations to those recipients. Remember students, attendance has to be your priority even in this virtual world, so make sure that you are attending your Zooms on a regular basis. I'm standing in front of the newly named Amistad Gymnasium, also known as the Bob Blankensop Gymnasium. The gymnasium at Amistad was named after Mr. Blankensop, our former principal, on December 1st of this past school year. So it is with my great privilege that in front of the Bob Blankensop Gymnasium, I get to announce the Principal Honor Award. 
We had two recipients of the Principal Honor Award, and in order to receive this award, you need to get all A's in at least five of your classes. Those recipients are Jasmine Portillo and Brian Morales. Congratulations, students. At this time, I'll be switching spaces on campus and be talking about our white cords at graduation. Hey Amistad High School, we're here to continue our virtual awards assembly and I am standing outside of room 220, also known as Mr. Miller's classroom, where senior studies takes place for Amistad High School and part of the senior studies curriculum, as you may know, involves planning for a life after high school. This includes completing a post-secondary application and a FAFSA. Not only is it part of the class, but it's also your way to earn a white cord at graduation. We want to see as many white cords as possible, so make sure that if you haven't already, complete your post-secondary application as well as the FAFSA application today. If you have questions, you can go to a, a virtual Room 220 or contact your counselors today. I'm pleased to share that Amistad High School already has 17 students that have completed the FAFSA, have completed a post-secondary application, and will have a white honor cord. Those 17 students are Isaac, Diego, Luis, Evan, Guadalupe, Ronaldo, Noisha, Sonia, Renee, Jasmine, Destiny, Leslie, Miriam, Elijah, Eternity, Gennaro, and Raymond. If we didn't list your name, reach out to your counselor to make sure you turn in all of the parts for your honor cord at graduation. Thanks, Amistad High School, and here's our next presenter, Ms. Hoff. The 25 Club, if you want to make that, you have to pass all of your classes. And we're very proud that first quarter, 43 students have this honor. And moving closer towards graduation, second quarter, 71 students. And the entire staff is looking forward to increasing that number more. So think about that each week when you're attending so you can pass your classes and be in the 25 Club third quarter. It, the names will be listed on our website, so make sure you go to the website. It's very informational, and check out your name on there. And next, Miss Para. Thank you, Miss Hoff. That is a lot of student recognition, and we're not done yet. We have a tradition at Amistad High of awarding students who have earned 190 credits with Spirit Wear, a t-shirt with the Amistad logo and Eagle to signify Eagles on our way to graduation. And we just want to encourage you to um, see graduation to completion. And already we have 38 students um, ready to receive their Spirit Wear. And just a side note, we, um, have several uh, shirts already made and if we run out of your size we will definitely order more because we want you to just proudly display your Amistad Eagle spirit wear. Here are the Eagles on our way at this time. Anthony Ortiz, Jesus Havens, Isaiah Baca, Israel Rodriguez, Isaac Garza, Jose Soto, Angela Muro, Dylan Wagner, Fabian Delira, Antonio Moreno Martinez, Paul Moreno, Deonce Nathaniel, Diana Rios Gutierrez, Maria Camacho Mendez, Manuel Aguilera Diaz, Michael Burke, Alina Manriquez, Samantha Ramirez, Jose Jarmillo Duran, Janice Mendez, Adrian Morales, Mario Osornio Keller, Eddie Sevilla Torres, Felix Torres Angulo, Jonathan Barajas, David Jimenez, Brian Rodriguez, Xavier Sanchez, Gabriel Amaya, Manuel Diaz, Sela Gomez, Jesus Havens, Sebastian Lopez Arechiga, Daniel Morales, and Crystal Torres. 
We are so proud of our Eagles soaring at Amistad High School and thank you for participating in Amistad Recognition Assembly today.